welcome to lab 9 part 3 where we will cover the forward, backwards and centered finite difference in Excel. So here in Excel I have the columns for our x and y data. We will calculate the first derivative and second derivative using FFD, BFD and CFD. To get started we must populate our x and y values. Our x values will go from negative 1 incrementing by 0 0.1. Then I will select the two cells. Then click and drag the bottom right corner to auto generate. Now I'll set the last two cells to not applicable. In this video we we'll use the rank function as our y values. So this will be equal to 1 divided by 1 plus 25 times x squared where x is at a3 and then squared. Once again I will select and drag the corner to auto populate. Once again, I will set the last two to not applicable. I will now refer to the formulas on our right to calculate our derivatives. We will first start with the first derivative using FFD, which is equal to so the equal sign. Then the numerator is FIXI plus 1, which is B4, minus FIXI, which is at B3, divided by the denominator, which is XII plus 1 which is a 4 minus a3. Hit enter and then click and drag the corner. As you can see we were unable to calculate the last data point since we required a successive data point which did not exist. Moving on to the second derivative which is equal to FIXI plus 2 minus 2 times FIXI plus 1 plus FIXI divided by H squared which is at A4 minus A3 and then squared. Go ahead and drag the cell. For this one you can see we were unable to find the last two derivatives. This is because we required two successive cells that did not exist. Moving on to BFD, where the first derivative is equal to FIXI minus 1 minus FIXI divided by XII minus 1 minus XII. And then go ahead and drag this. Here you can see the first derivative cannot be found since it depends on a previous cell which does not exist. Then for the second derivative, which is equal to FIXI minus 2 times FIXI minus 1 plus FIXI minus 2 or divided by H squared which is A2 minus A3 or squared. Once again click and drag. In this case the first two derivatives cannot be found since it depends on two previous cells which do not exist. Finally, moving on to CFD, which is equal to FIXI plus 1 minus FIXI minus 1 divided by 2 times H, which is A4 minus A3. For this one, you can see the first derivative does not exist, and the last derivative also does not exist. CFD can also be calculated as the average of the forward and backwards finite difference. So we can do that by setting it equal to FFD plus B FD divided by 2 and we get the same results. Now for the second derivative which is equal to FIXI plus 1 minus 2 times FIXI plus FIXI minus 1 divided by H squared will be A4 minus A3 and then squared. Once again extend that and here you can see the first derivative does not exist and the last derivative also does not exist. 